Let's have a look around this uh, 1954, I think, this one. Um, 1954 Morris Minor, Series 2. Um, finished in maroon with uh, red interior. Originally supplied by uh, Vincent's of Reading, so it hasn't been far. Well, it may have been far and come back again, but um, Vincent's were the main uh, Reading Austin Morris dealer in the, uh, the 1950s and 60s. And there's a little plaque on the dash to say so. Um, so, finished in maroon, standard uh, Series 2 Minor spec, really. It's even got working traffic haters on it. And it's a really sweet little car. It's got its original type rear lights, small rear window, uh, and best of all, the original dash, which uh, we'll come back on to. Let's go around and pick out some good bits and bad bits. Very little in the way of bad bits. Um, the last owner treated it uh, to four new heritage wings, um, which are very, very nice all round. It's been repainted at some point in its life, clearly. It was originally, it did start life black. Um, and there's some of the uh, the Mazak and stuff on the uh, around the front end is uh, really quite pitted. The lamp units um, are good, but the uh, the stuff around the grill is quite uh, badly pitted. It's the original type um, cheese grater grill on it. Some paint loss just down here, and we've got some paint loss and electrolytic reaction just on this um, uh, section of trim along here. That's really about it. it looks very. Uh, very straight down the sides. Um, oh, really nice. Roof's nice, bonnet's good. Passenger door is all nice. The fit towards the back of the door could be slightly better. That may be adjustable just to get that in a bit. Interior wise, she's actually not in bad shape. The, uh, I presume these are the original seats are in quite good shape. A couple of bits of um, worn stitching on them here and there. Uh, and there is, if I get out again, uh, there's a, uh, a hole in the trim on the back of the um, back of the rear seat backrest. Put a travel rug over it, I guess, is the answer to that one. Um, but the rest of the interior, the door cards, carpets, etc. Headlining's really good. Um, we're actually not in bad shape. The offside rear trim underneath the window there isn't the finest, shall we say, but it is what... Uh, 62 years old, but yeah, the dash. Um, so being an early early miner, it's got the original Art Deco style dash on it with its Vincent's of Reading badge. Um, absolutely lovely. Original uh, sprung steering wheel, handbrake, everything. All nice in the uh, the A posts, the B posts, um, seals etc. Are very good on this one. a bit of a slam. Probably could do a little bit of adjusting at the bottom of the passenger door there. Um, near side rear wing it's all nice, it's all good round here. Again a couple of bits of paint loss on the bumpers but that's normal. Um, tailgate, oh, sorry not tailgate, um, the boot lid is very good and it's not rotten along the bottom edge here. Um, it's all nice in there. Uh, looking down the offside, <coughs> excuse me, it looks very straight down the offside all round. A couple of bits of touching in just here, just, just there, has gone on at some point. But otherwise, there's a, a sort of mark just there, but uh, marking the paint just there, but no more than that. Door bottoms all look good. Again, it's had new wings on it. We've talked about that. Um, and inside here, the driver's seat's in good shape. The carpets could benefit from a bit of a clean. We haven't actually vacuumed this one out. I managed to miss that one. Anyway. Um, well, there's a couple of marks on the rear seat, but no more than that. So headlining's nice. Uh, yeah, nice, uh, really nice example of this one. It drives really, really well. A couple of nicks in the bottom of the driver's door card just there. That's about it. My name's Simon. You can reach me in the office on 0118-907-1495. Or you can go to our website, which is www.motodrome.co.uk, for any further information.